continuando, ok? The topic of the class of today is about modal. This modal is should. What is the meaning of should? ¿Alguien sabe qué significa should? Should. No. ¿Debería ser, Miss? Debería, debería. Deberías, ok? Should es un modal y significa deberías, ok? Cuando alguien te da un consejo, por ejemplo, deberías obedecer a tu mamá, <ríe> en inglés, ok? Deberías se dice should. You should obey your parents. Deberías obedecer a tus padres, ¿ok? Should, entonces, significa deberías, ¿ok? You should. Y entonces, ¿qué significa shouldn't? Lo que voy a circular aquí. Shouldn't. No, no debería. 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 No debería, Miss. No debería. No debería. No debería. Excellent. Perfect. No debería. No debería. Is the negative part. Ok. So, let's continue. Look, we use should and shouldn't to give advice or talk about what we think is right or wrong. Nosotros deberíamos, o no bueno, usamos should, que es debería, o shouldn't, que es no deberías, to give advice, para dar un consejo, or talk about what we think is right or wrong, o para decir si algo, bueno, para compartir un pensamiento, si algo es correcto o no es correcto. ¿Ok? For example, should. I repeat, ¿qué significa should? should? Deberías. Deberías, ok. For example, look, this is an example. You should, ok, you should, you should do your homework. ¿Qué significa esto? You should do your homework. Deberías hacer tu tarea. Deberías hacer tu tarea. Ajá, rea, excellent. Deberías hacer tu tarea. You should do your homework. Ok, you should do your homework. And now, this example is in negative. Ok, for example, you shouldn't watch TV or watch too much TV. Shouldn't. No deberías no debería ver mucho la tele. Ajá. You shouldn't watch too much TV. Ahora, en este caso nosotros vemos un ejemplo con should not. Should not significa no deberías. Recuerden que en este caso podemos unir estas dos palabras. La contraction. ¿Ok? Should not que significa no deberías, shouldn't, que ya está junto, unido, shouldn't, ¿ok? Y significa lo mismo, no deberías, ¿ok? What is the difference? Is, ¿ok? The pronunciation, es la pronunciación, should not, shouldn't, ¿ok? Ok, let's continue, example. What is says here? Pay attention. Our school. Teacher. Yes. Teacher, may I go to the bathroom, please? Yes, yes, Letty. Our school rules. The rules. Reglas, okay? Our school rules. Okay? For example, the number one says, you should o we should, in plural, we, nosotros, we should be hardworking and listen to the teachers. Teacher. Yes, Juan Diego Sánchez. Yes. Okay. ¿Qué significa we should be hardworking? 
Deberíamos, Deberíamos ser trabajadores. Ajá, very good, Dominic. And listen to the teachers. Y escuchar a los maestros. Excellent. This is one. Okay. Eh, this is a rule, right? Es una regla. Another. We should be polite and help others. Debemos ser polite significa respetuoso. Respetuoso. Debemos ser respetuosos y ayudar a la gente. Deberíamos ser respetuosos y ayudar a la gente. Ajá. In English, we should be polite and help others. ¿Ok? Continue. The number three. We should put, ¿ok? Leader in the trash. We should, ¿ok? Put leader, for example, this is leader, ¿ok? The leader on the trash, ¿ok? Deberíamos should... poner la basura en el techo de basura. Ajá. Uh -huh. Yes. We should put leader in the trash. This is example of some rules, okay? And some rules in negative. For example, we shouldn't shout ah in class. We shouldn't shout ah. No, no, no. Es gritar en clase, en clase. Ajá. Yes. Yes. Excellent. We shouldn't shout in class. Another rule is we shouldn't be naughty or laugh at people. Okay. No deberíamos ser traviesos o, o reírnos or laugh. o laugh. Reírnos de las personas. Ajá. Yes. Very good. Okay, students. So, Here you are going to see examples of rules using should for positive and shouldn't for negative, ¿ok? Ok, hasta ahí está todo claro, chicos. Entendemos muy bien cuál es el significado el de teacher. should y shouldn't. Ok, very good. Ok, let's continue, ¿ok? Open your English book, students, in page number... 21, page number, what page? What is the number of the page? 21. 21, 21. yes. 71. Ajá, 71? <laughs> no, 21. 21. <laughs> yes. We practiced the numbers. Creo que practicamos los números, creo, ¿no? We practiced the numbers. Ah, excellent. Okay. Oh, chau, 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 chau. Okay, let's continue. Complete the sentences. Okay, what is the instruction, students? What is the instruction in English? Complete, 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 or complete, complete the sentence with or shoulder. Okay, listen, students. Complete the sentences. These sentences complete with should or shouldn't. Shouldn't. Aquí la pronunciación es como si la o no se pronunciara. Should. Shouldn't, okay? Okay, for example, in number one, here it says, you, okay, use a cell phone, this is a cell phone, on a bike. You should use a cell phone on a bike, or you no. shouldn't use a cell shouldn't. phone on a bike. Shouldn't. Shouldn't. Excellent. Very good. Continue another. The number two. You, te está hablando a ti. You, tú, o también puede ser ustedes. You. Ok, here it says stop, stop, ok, stop at green traffic light. Oh, stop. Showing. Stop at green, color green, traffic light. 
Excellent. You shouldn't stop at green traffic light. Tú no deberías parar en eh, la luz verde del semáforo. At green traffic light. ¿Qué pasa si tú te detienes justo cuando está en color verde? Hay un tráfico, mira, un tráfico y no dejes pasar, no de pasar a los demás. Claro, solamente te debes de parar cuando está en color rojo, color red, ¿ok? Ok, let's continue. Ok, let's continue. The number three. Number three. You stop, stop at a red traffic light. You should. 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 You should. Excellent. You should stop at a red traffic light. Okay, continue working. Okay, continue. Read and complete, the students. Read and complete. I'm going to call victims. Voy a llamar a víctimas. Ustedes saben que víctimas son, <laughs> les digo los alumnos que no levantan la mano, sino que yo los escojo al azar. Ok, escojo un alumno de la lista, escojo al azar. Ok, I'm going to choose a victim. Ok, let's complete, complete the sentences in number four, number five, number six. Ok, we finished activity number three. We finished, ok, we complete the activity number three. Okay, and now let's continue with activity number four. Pero antes de continuar, por favor, díganme, ¿están entendiendo hasta ahí? ¿Hay algo que no entienden, Miss Elaya? No, sí entendemos, teacher. Entendemos. Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Yeah. Okay, okay, thank you. Miss. Yes, Sophie. Miss, le quería decir que a mí no me llamó la lista. Sofía Quispe, Sofía Quispe, Sofía Quispe, un momento, Sofía. Ya, ahorita voy a verificar, ya, Sofía. Continue. Bien. In activity number four, read. Ok, you have to read. A estas alturas tú ya tienes que saber qué significa read. What is the meaning of read? Leer. Leer, leer ¿no? Leer. Read. Cuando nosotros tenemos una clase de lectura, yo digo reading, lectura, ¿no? Reading. Read and write. What is the meaning of write? You are intelligent. What is write? Uh -huh. Escribir. Perfecto, mi querido Adriano. Lee y escribe. Read and write. Okay, the instruction is read and write sentences using, okay, should or shouldn't. For example, in number one, we are, we, okay, all, All fifth grade, todo el salón de quinto grado, we, nosotros, we are at the movie theater, ¿ok? We are here at the movie theater. Do you remember the movie theater? One moment, please. <laughs> What happened? We are at the movie theater. Hello, hello. What are you? Okay. We are here in the movie theater. Continue. And we get a text. We get a text. Okay. We get a text. Oh, ding. It's a text. We want to text our friend. We want to text our friend. So the sentence is we should text in the movie theater. Or we shouldn't text in the movie theater. What is that correct? Should or shouldn't text? Is here in the example. 
We shouldn't. Yes. We shouldn't. It's a recommendation, a suggestion. Es una sugerencia. En este caso, más que una sugerencia, es una regla, ¿verdad? It's a rule. Continue with the number two. The number two. We are on the street, okay? We are on the street, okay? For example, in, in Los Olivos. We are in Los Olivos on the street. We want to go to the shopping mall, okay? And there is a crosswalk. We want to go to the shopping mall and there is a crosswalk. Look, this is a crosswalk. Okay, there is a crosswalk. Can you see the crosswalk? Yes? Look. Yes. Yes. There is a crosswalk. Continue. We are on the street. We want to go to the shopping mall. There is a crosswalk. Here it says, we should, should. use the crosswalk. The crosswalk. We should use the crosswalk. Or we shouldn't use the crosswalk. We should. Yes. We should. We should use the crosswalk. Hay personas, han habido, ustedes saben que la mayoría de los accidentes es por irresponsabilidad también de los peatones, que somos nosotros, ¿no? Los que estamos prácticamente cruzando las calles. En este caso, nosotros debemos cruzar por estas rayitas blancas, ¿ok? Porque por ahí, eso indica que por ahí tienen que cruzar los peatones, ¿ok? Ok, we should use the crosswalk, ¿ok? Eso es para también cuidar de nosotros, ¿no? Ok, we should use the crosswalk. Continue with the number three. We are, okay, what place, students? We are, look. We are, we are at the museum. We are, yes. We are at the museum. Yes, we are at the museum, okay? This is a museum. I'm going to write museum and paintings. Yeah, okay, this is museum and paintings. Okay. We are in the museum. We are here. Hmm, okay, here. This is a museum. So we, all the class, we are at the museum. We see a painting. What is a painting? This is La a pintura. painting. This is a painting. Look. We see a beautiful painting. Ajá, la pintura, exactly. We see a painting. We want, we want to touch the painting. Touch. Show. Okay. Shouldn't. What is shouldn't. the correct shouldn't. sentences? We should. We should touch the painting. We shouldn't. 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 Yes. We shouldn't touch the painting. Don't touch. Porque si agarramos la pintura, la pintura se puede manchar. Ajá. Yes. For example, in some in some places, okay, says don't touch. Don't touch significa no tocar, okay? No se puede tocar, don't touch. Look at this advice, don't touch, okay? No tocar se dice don't touch, don't touch. Touch es obviamente tocar, no? Don't touch. Continue, students, another one. Chicos, si se cierra la sesión de Zoom, ya saben que tenemos unos, vamos a tener tres minutitos de break, porque hace rato tuvieron ya su tiempo, y luego continuamos con la segunda parte. Continue, the number four. We are at the shopping mall. Shopping mall, for example, Plaza Norte. We want to run and shout, ah, with a friend. Okay. So what do you think? We should run and shout in the shopping mall? 
or we shouldn't write.